13 of our 25 days of beer. And it's kind of sad, we're actually now three-fifths of the way done with this experiment. That's some fractions for you. Well. What are we drinking today? Well, speaking of fractions and going to math and all that stuff, every kid lives for a snow day. So we're Ooh. actually drinking snow day from New Belgium Brewery out of Colorado. Because we want to avoid those fractions. Yes. You <laughs> What's your, okay. what's your favorite fraction? My favorite fraction? <laughs> well, your favorite number is two. Yeah. So if you have a favorite number, why can't you have a favorite fraction? Make no damn sense. All right, so this is going to be today's question for Facebook and Instagram. Uh, Rob, you'll have to remember to put that up for day 15. What's your favorite fraction? Anyway, so tell if us you about... you have a favorite fraction, you need to drink more beer and not worry about fractions. Look, um, just because you're not into numbers doesn't mean our audience isn't into numbers. I was in, I'm into numbers. I love math. That was my favorite subject growing up. Well, we'll let you do the books from now on. Well, didn't pass accounting, but I love math. <laughs> um, so tell us about this beer, Snow Day. This is a winter, one of their winter ales that they do at New Belgium. Um, it's very citrusy, almost, I would say. Uh, There's something like hanging out on the back of my tongue. Yeah, I can't grab the, I can't really grab that flavor. It's almost orangey, but not really orangey, but it's something. Very interesting. It's, it's coming in right at about 6.1%, 6.2. So not a ton of alcohol, but it's saying that, um, what about this dark cal caramel roasted midnight wheat brace? So is that the wheat that we're tasting? Probably the wheat. The With yeast. <laughs> I can't even talk. Yes, the yeast. With a serious load of golding, centennial, and cascade hops. What a deliciously, now you're giving me your can't talk. What a deliciously unexpected way to spend a snow day. And it is 6.2. Yeah, so... If you're snowed in anywhere, make sure you get the beer prior to getting snowed in. Yeah, just save it till when you're going to get snowed in. And if you don't feel like going to the store, you can always do Instacart. Hopefully, you have Instacart in your area. I love Instacart. I Tim actually found. Tiffany's just lazy, don't want to go to the store. Well, so but I was shopping because you could get uh, Instacart around us. You can get our grocery store delivers and our liquor store delivers. And I actually found this New Belgian. 12 pack at our local ABC store um, for only like 10, 11 dollars, which is pretty good for a 12 pack. Well, everybody runs a special every now and then. So I encourage Instacart because you can watch and see what's on sale and have them deliver your food and or booze straight to your door. And I don't get paid, I just really like Instacart. Rob says I'm lazy, I just say I'm very efficient. I love going to the store. Get to buy more stuff than you need. But, you can do that on Instacart too. And you can see beer without actually having to see beer. It's like going. That's like going to um, Home Depot for a man. Just walk around, and look at the different things. Same thing in the grocery store. You go down to beer out and just see what what's the buy and buy and buy. But with this, make sure you get you some snow day. Ooh, um, if what, you're what, not what, in. What what's on the must have list for you if you're snowed in for a snow day? A couple things you can't be without on a snow day. So what question you want to ask me? You can't either get in fractions or you're getting what you must need for a snow day. I can ask two questions. Nope, you're getting only one. So with that, Tiffany can ask that. Um, get some snow day. Make sure you and if you're if you're not going to get snowed in because we live in Florida, so there's there zero no hats of in. it's snowing in. Like we got rained in today for about at least two hours, so. Though your parents did call and say, should they go home because it was raining hard? No, they thought it was a tornado warning. And I'm like, it's winter. There's no tornadoes happening in winter. They do. You have warnings in winter. They never hit. So, well, enjoy your snow day. Everybody, cheers. And now we can go.